So here is our chart available to us. Now if you wanted to change the style of this chart, we can. So if we go to the top of the ribbon and select chart styles, expand those options and let's select chart style 43. So we select that one, that looks quite nice. So if we decide to use this style and if we quite like this style and we wanted to use it for our other charts that we submit in the future, we can set this style as a template. So with your chart selected, you can see under the design tab, there is an option called save as template. So if you select this, it will open the default folder for your chart style templates. So don't change this folder because this is the folder it will look for when you select your style in the future. So all we need to do is to give our chart style a name. So let's say, um, let's call it default chart style and click save. So this is our first chart that we're going to submit. So if we wanted to create a second chart, we have on this sheet some further sales information. We can select this information and again, select insert from the menu and from the ribbon, we'll select again a column chart, 3D column chart. Now, it hasn't yet defaulted to our default style, so we need to select it. So, what we can do is if we select change chart type and then from templates at the top of the column in the change top change chart type window you can see we have a style saved if we hover over it it will display the name default chart style we can select this and click OK and it will apply our default style that we like to our chart. Bye-bye.